Thank you, Margie. Well, Fox 2 is honoring Black History Month, and the Missouri History Museum has a whole lineup for you to explore and appreciate the stories of prominent African Americans making contributions to history. Cecily Hunter, public historian and African American History Initiative, joins us with a preview of some of their exhibits happening this month. Good morning to you. Good morning. Okay, so I looked at the calendar, and you guys have stuff going on almost every day of February. Tell me a little bit about what we can expect to see. We do. We have tons of programs going on throughout the month. Uh, February 2nd, so that's literally tomorrow, we have Artists and Number One in Civil Rights, Exhibit and Beyond. And then on February 3rd, we have Storytime. Uh, this is specifically talking about black Missourians. Um, and then February 24th, we have programs that cater toward talking about war, and that's at the Military Museum, Soldiers Memorial. Um, and then on February 24th, we're talking about black resistance, right? And that's specifically about um, black Missourians. February 10th and February 11th, we'll have our history exploration days, and that's specifically catered toward migration and movements. So, I mean, we have endless possibilities for folks to come out and, and get some knowledge, uh, learn some history, deep dive into what's going on at the History Museum. Okay, and I do wanna say that uh, you all have made it a point to uh, make sure that these exhibits extend beyond uh, just the month of February and just Black History Month. We want uh, people to come visit now, but you guys will continue to showcase Black history. Absolutely. So every month we'll have ongoing program um, at least once a month that caters toward our African American History Initiative. We also have opportunities to expand our collecting efforts um, and this is ongoing. So we always are collecting unique artifacts okay. and materials. Uh, so the possibilities are endless. Okay, uh, tell me a little bit about the um, age ranges or age groups that will uh, be able to appreciate and understand uh, the exhibits most. So, so to be honest, like all age groups are able to appreciate and understand. We make sure that our programs, um, if it is a bit of higher knowledge, we make sure that there are programs that cater toward our young people mm -hmm. so that we are exploring these topics in a way that meets them where they are, but then also appreciation for our adult population as well. So all are welcome. <laughs> okay, so you have some uh, artifacts, you have stories, you have different themes. Give us a, tell us a little bit about what your favorite exhibit is or what you're looking forward to most. So right now we are specifically focusing on coloring STL and it deep dives about um, architecture in St. Louis. Mm. And so it's pretty awesome where literally from all age groups, you can literally color on the walls. Uh, we have representations of Poro College there, Homer G. Phillips and other places as well. So we have artifacts that are available. Uh, but how cool is it to be able to color on the wall of the museum? <laughs> <laughs> love that, love that. So people uh, will have an opportunity to come out and uh, see these exhibits and really gain an appreciation. Uh, we will have that information for you guys on our website. So you can watch that calendar too and pick and choose which ones you want to go see. Just go and visit our website, fox2now.com. Tossing it back to you, Ty.